Hi, guys. I got to say, this show came from out of nowhere for me. I guess I live under a rock. I don't know. But like, I was like, oh, the boys, let's check this out. And it just blew me away. I couldn't believe it. it was so good. And my poor wife, I dragged her into watching it. And she's like, oh, this is pretty good. I think I like this. And then she was like, oh, people are exploding. And she was a little bit traumatized by it. But she was so good, she watched the whole damn thing with me. <laughs> I think she still has a little bit of PTSD, but it was awesome. So thank you so much, and thank you for coming to Toronto. Um, Dread 2, do you think it'll happen? <laughs> uh, Let me what? field this one. Yeah, Jack? <laughs> We're working on it. No, go ahead. Oh, really? They are working on it. Um, here's the deal. I know that the, the guys who have the rights to it, Rebellion, are currently working on developing a TV show called Mega City One. I have no doubt that will happen at some point in the future, whether or not I'll be a part of it. I don't know. I'm sort of committed to doing the boys. Um, but uh, naturally, I would love to be a part of it. Um, but regardless or not, I cannot wait to see what they do with it. And it'll be something completely different than Dread. So. But thank you very much. Appreciate that. Thank you. And that was a great impression of your wife. <laughs> Amazing. She'd be flattered. Why Anthony knows what your wife sounds like, I don't want to know. <laughs> My ex-wife. True. <laughs> she, she don't want me doing impressions of her. <laughs> Moving along. <laughs> Moving along. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> How will you grow the... Uh, the Judge Dredd character, if you take on that uh, role again. And I would, like to sub I would like to present you with this subpoena. He's, you're presenting me with a subpoena, but he's standing yes. in line. <laughs> <laughs> are, there, are there Judge, uh, judge Dredd? No, I've got other subpoenas. Let's not talk about it. Yeah. Please, present away. Yeah. Thank you very much. A subpoena. Oh, this is so exciting. Thank you. And what am I being subpoenaed for? Uh, all right, lovely. <laughs> Uh, this subpoena orders a person or organization to submit the following digital evidence for... You're not getting that shot, mate. <laughs> Steady on, tiger. <laughs> Bloody hell. <laughs> but if you come to the photo booth later on... <laughs> me and Jack are going to do uh, some photos later on. Have, have you done yours? 5.30. Uh, I did mine. He did his for the day, uh, but the two of them have photo ops at 5.30. Come see us at photo ops, and I'll, I'll do this for you, all right? <laughs> Wow. All right. No, get your head out of the gutter. <laughs> Unbelievable. People. <laughs> this I can do. <laughs> that I can't. <laughs> Unless, how much money have you got? <laughs> no. All right. Never mind. It's a different convention. <laughs> yeah, that's furries. Yeah. <laughs> that's that's yeah. right. Uh, hi, guys. Uh, this message is for Anthony and Carl. If there ever was a smackdown between Homelander and Judge Dredd, who would win and why? Homelander and Judge Dredd? Laser eyes, bitch. I don't know. Judge Dredd's smart. Like he'd, take, he would, he'd use his brains to defeat Homelander. The laser, granted, the laser eyes are a bit of a fucking problem. I'd have to work around that. <laughs>